Question number four. Shea, Marie, and a man are playing a game where a spinner with the numbers 1 to 20 is spun. Shea wins if 2, 4, 5, 7, 8, 9, 11, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, or 20 comes up. Marie wins if 3, 7, 8, 9, 12, 16, 18 comes up. And a man wins if 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8, 9, 10, 12, 17, 18 comes up. Find P of I, the probability of I. That's the probability that a man will win. So a man wins if 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There are 11 numbers where she wins out of a total number of 20. She wins 11 times out of 20. A little bit more than 50%. What's the probability of S and I? That means probability that Shea and a man will both win. Shea and a man is this region right here. This region is inside the Shea circle and it's inside the Aman circle. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven numbers, seven out of 20. What's the probability that Shea will win given that a man won? I'm gonna do the formula first. The probability of S given I is equal to the probability of S and I divided by the probability of I. The probability of S and I, we already figured it out. It's seven on 20. The probability of I, we've already figured out. It's 11 on 20. We're dividing these two fractions. When you divide fractions, you multiply by the reciprocal of the dividing fraction. 7 over 20 times 20 over 11. The 20s cancel. You get 7 out of 11. For I, how many people are in I? There are 11 people in here, like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 in I. How many are in S? that are also in I. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven out of 11. Well, you can do this logically or you can use the formula. Same answer. What's the probability of S and M and I? That's the probability that Shea and Marie and Men will all win. That's the section right here in the center. It's this, this section right here. And there are three numbers there out of the total 20, three out of 20. And that's it for question number four.